still going to be something that's going to motivate you through this process? Yeah, yeah. Um, we, we definitely have started that. Uh, it's probably going to be about the eight to nine week process um, before I'm medically cleared. And if so that was what timetable wise, I don't know if you'd qualify because this happened over a month ago. So you say eight to nine weeks or from what I venture, you're not going to be cleared more than likely. There's a very likely possibility that you are not going to be medically cleared for Haunted Hell has four. Yeah. yeah. Uh, if you do the math, that takes you about um, the second week into November. Yeah, that's uh, that's exactly what I thought. The odds realistically of you coming back are almost none because, again, if you do the math, I mean, you're not going to come back a week early, two weeks early, right? If you're medically not able to return till mid-November, you wouldn't want to risk that now, would you? Yeah, and, and so with that saying, I am more likely not going to be able to compete at a Haunted Hill Plus 4. And I, I'm not sure how Showtime is going to take that. Mm. Um, but how, would he, well, how do you think he would take it, hypothetically, if you can't go out there? I mean, I'm sure, I'm sure he's going to just attack me regardless. I mean, he, Bob, he's, you locked the doors this time because, you know, last time you were here, Nate Dog came in and beat you up and senselessly attacked you. So are you safe right now where you are? Yes, I do have security guard in the house. Uh, That's having, very kind of you. It's very kind that you're able to get a security guard and you're obviously concerned for your life right now. I mean, have you been fearing your life right now? Have you been fearing everything when it comes to, let's say, PBS as an example? Yeah, I, I don't even go outside right now. I, oh, my goodness. 